Hey guys, this is Pilbet, and today I'm showing you how to install Team Win Recovery Project in root your Asus and Watch 2. So these are the files that I'm going to be using to install Team Win Recovery uh, Super SU and BusyBox. Um, I got these from I got BusyBox from right here, uh, Team Win from here, and Super SU from here. Uh, I'll leave the links in the description. So you also need ADB for this process. Uh, I got ADB from here. It's called 15 second ADB installer. And you also need the ADB drivers. Uh, I could not find the ASUS ZenWatch 2 ADB drivers anywhere, but apparently uh, this installer found the, detected it and installed the drivers. So once you downloaded um, all of these files and set them up, go ahead and open up a command prompt window and navigate to the folder where you have all the files. So I'm going to go to desktop. Uh, ZenWatch. And we're going to go ahead and reboot it into uh, fastboot mode. So we're going to do ADB reboot uh, bootloader. We're going to run ADB reboot bootloader. Right here. And there we go. You can see we are now in fastboot mode. So once your watch is booted into fastboot mode, you're going to have to unlock the bootloader if you have not done so already. So just type in fastboot OEM unlock. Uh, as you can see, I've already unlocked my bootloader. Um, if you go ahead and do this, it's going to factory reset your watch, so watch out for that. Um, in most cases, you're not going to lose any data since everything's synced up with your phone. Um, unless you have a sideloaded apps, you're going to lose those, but those can be easily reinstalled. So next, we're going to do uh, go ahead and flash recovery. So we're going to do fast boot, flash recovery, and team recovery three. And we're going to send it over. All right. So now that that's done, we can go ahead and reboot the watch. So I'm going to go do fast boot reboot and uh, give it a second. All right. So next, we're going to do ADB reboot recovery. And I'm going to go ahead and switch to my phone. Show you that this is. Uh, recovery. You can see we are now in uh, Team Win Recovery Project, but now we have to go ahead and send over the files to install to go ahead and root it. Alright, so next we're going to go ahead and push over the files that we need to root the watch, which is why we navigate to the, uh, the directory that we put the files in. So to do that, we're going to do ADB push and uh, let's see if we, we're going to use super user and do SD card. We're now going to go ahead and send it for BusyBox. Uh, this is optional, but uh, I figured I might as well include this. So we're going to do ADB push um, BusyBox SSD card. And as you can see, that's pushed over. So now I'm going to go ahead and switch over to my uh, phone and show you how to install this. Alright, so now that our files are on the watch, we're going to go ahead and click install, install zip, scroll down to the bottom. So we're going to go ahead and install Super SU, check, confirm. Alright, so now that's done, we're going to go back, install zip. We're going to, oops, I don't want to install it again. Install BusyBox. And this one, this won't take as long. Alright, there we go. And if anyone wants to install a custom kernel, your most kernels are, I believe, .img files or something. Just click install image instead. Uh, as you can see, I have, let's see if I can get this focus. Hang on. Let's see if this is better. Yep, yeah, there we go. So as you can see, I have momentum and uh, end kernel spare release, which are kernels. So that's how you uh, can flash those. So, um, we're going to go ahead and reboot. And as you can see, um, right as it got into the uh, boot animation, it rebooted. That's just due to the uh, Super SU installation process. Alright, so it just loaded in. Let me go ahead and... Uh, Log in real quick.
Alright, so we're going to go ahead and open up the Super SU or Root Access Checker app thing, a jig, yeah. Um, should be down here, I believe. There it is. I'm going to go ahead, verify root, and there we go. So I hope you guys liked the video, and hopefully this helped somebody out, and I'll see you next weekend.